Hey guys, welcome back. Um, between last episode and this episode, I grabbed a little stone from out there by our little uh, pathway thing. It's a little bit bigger now. <laughs> I just hauled out this area with my awesome pick, which goes really quickly, so I can just run on through here and hack away at it. Um, so, let's go back in and try to see if we can't get at least let's try checking out these first things now that we've uh, disabled all of the spawners on these first rows here okay this one we already checked here it's a creeper somewhere nope oh! okay so you know what let's just block that off And oh no. Oh. <laughs> okay, yeah, this one's getting blocked off too. I'll take both these torches though. Blocked off. Blocked off. I'm like fully blocking off this one because I don't want to fall in there. <laughs> wow, this skeleton this one skeleton is just an awful shot. Except when I'm moving. How does that make sense? He's an awful shot until I'm a moving target and then he just becomes fantastic and hits me anyway uh, so let's see today we will be attempting to find the green wool still <laughs> um, I don't know keeps me from going down there so that's all I need I check down here Enchanted leather armor. <gasps> Total useless. Okay. Um. Now. Let's, uh. Dig out these blocks. And then drink this, uh. 8 minute fire resist potion. And let's get started. Oop. Not what I wanted to throw. Oh well. Hopefully one block won't matter too much. And the guests have already spawned. I mean, gas. <laughs> They're not gas. What are they? I don't remember. Let's go this way. Okay, you just need to get down. You need to die because you're annoying. And I can't get past you while you're in the way. <laughs> and, okay, did the volume get turned up again? Because this is incredibly loud. Okie dokie. Break this one. Okay, dude, just move out of the way. Or die. I guess that's your option. Your choice, I mean. Oh, I missed. Whoa, lag. Okay, I'm just going to turn the sound down some more because I can't even hear myself over that. So... Let's just, uh... Nope! Nope! Okay. I hate skeletons. Ugh. <laughs> All of my problems come from skeletons. Get back. Seriously. All of my problems arise from skeletons. Okay. There we go. Let's stick that there. Ah, hey! How did you even get there? I'd like to knock the zombie off, too. Oh, oh, skeleton fight. Oh. Nope. Oh. And we're down again. <laughs> oh, jeez. The blazes are going to make everything so angry. I'm immune to fire. Ah! And everything's going to be so laggy, too. Okay, guys. Uh, stop it! Where are they? Okay.
Oh, really? Oh, jeez. I'm actually getting pretty low on health here. Look at, there's so many skeletons here. And there's so much fire, they should all be dying. Or angering each other or something. Okay, I already took care of this one. And Okay, let's hop on up here. Take down the skeleton spawners. There we go. Okie dokie. Now, what? where? Where? I'm being shot at by skeletons, but I don't really know where they are. So, oh, there they are. Hey, creeper. What's up? Oh, boy. This will be fun. Oh, nice creeper. I gotta say that's a success for him. So. Nope. And we're good. And is there a skeleton up here? No? Alright, I'm just lighting this area up with a glowstone because... Um, uh, there's so many mobs spawning all over the... What, where am I getting shot at from? There's so many skeletons shooting me and I don't even know where they are. Okay, I need more uh, blaze powder, so I suppose it can't hurt to kill some blazes. Do I have any blaze rods on me? I have one. I'm almost wishing, wishing I didn't have knockback right now. Just because it's making it so hard to kill the blazes. Um, cause, eh, stop it. Stop it! Spider jockey! And something broke. My helmet. <laughs> I love how the zombies and uh, blazes are fighting each other here. Okay, you're just annoying. That's what you are. Oh, yes, you are. You shoot. No, mm -mm. <laughs> ah! Okay, guys, let's just, uh,. Eat this bread, and then run back. And, uh, yeah. If you can hear my mom's music, I'm sorry. <laughs> um, I really am. But, uh, there's not much I can do about it. So. Um, okie doke. Let's see, we've got... Oh, we've got a bunch of blaze powder, actually. You know, let's... Let's run over here. See if we don't have any, uh slimes over here. Um, because I'm going to need more of the... What did I just get stuck in? <laughs> I went to check the time and uh, managed to get myself stuck in a hole immediately. But that's okay. Oh, it's uh, dawn? Dusk? Dawn? Okay, that way would be north, so it's it's morning. I see no mobs. It's not exactly what I was expecting. I guess I was correct in thinking that um this area was well enough lit or well lit enough. I don't even know, guys, but um this area down here is definitely not well enough lit. And as such, mobs are still spawning down here, which means the slimes won't be so I need to light up this area. Oh, thank you, spider. But, uh, no thanks. <laughs> the blazes are fighting things. Get back. I don't care if the spawners are lit up, or unlit. I just need the, everything else to be lit up. Still got 50 seconds of fire resistance, so I don't need to worry about, uh, falling in the lava. I was going to say, but I do need to get rid of those spiders. I hate to use glowstone so much, but it's just what I've got on me right now. <laughs> Alright, looks like this area is set. 
Okie dokie. This place should be light enough now, yeah? I think so. Apparently not for the zombies. Or skeletons. Yeah, yeah, your blazes. Oh, jeez. <laughs> okay, now I'm a little scared. Because there's like a hundred bajillion blazes here. And no slimes. At all. Like, I was expecting at least one, but apparently that's just too much. It's too much to ask for. So, um, I've been thinking about what map to play next because, obviously, I want to keep doing this. Um, I'm going to try to balance it between the Let's Play, though, because I haven't been doing any of that lately, and I feel really bad about it. Um, so, I'll... Uh, once this map is done, I'll go back to the Let's Play, get some things straight, how that's working out, like I said I would in a previous video. And, uh... Yeah. I'm going to try to upload these videos, like, all at once, though, because, uh... You guys have waited long enough for these videos to come out, so if you're waiting for the uh, the other ones, uh, the other uh, oh, I only need three. I didn't, I didn't mean to make four there. If you're waiting for these ones, then I'm sorry. Yeah, I've oh, oh, almost did something bad there. Need another one. Um, brr, ugh. There we go. Um, okay, that's going to take a minute. Let's see what we've got here. Put that away. Put that away. Really, I have the one. Just put that away. Um, okay. Really need that. Those are the same thing. Excuse me. I have a helmet in here? I don't seem to. Um, nope. Alrighty. In the newest uh, snapshot, these potions, um, they, uh, <laughs> they something, that's for sure. Um, they brew faster. The brewing time has been reduced to 20 seconds, which I'm not currently on that build, but it is useful to know in either case. Uh, let's just stick that there, because it's really dark in here. I don't expect it to be close to this side, honestly. Um, I figure it's most likely... Well, the blue is over there, so I expect the green one to be over there somewhere. Oop. Enchanted gold armor. Let's see what's on it. Protection, protection, feather falling, protection, protection, respiration. Right, not useful at all. Not even a little bit. Is there a creeper somewhere? Nope. That's my footsteps. <laughs> I knew that. On down here? Nope. Nothing. I suppose he probably could hide something in there. But if he did it, well... Eh, I don't know if I'd notice it. Get back. Little butthead. Ow! I hate you! I hate... Just... Just die. You and your... F oh! Oh! We seem to have hit the dark area and or... I don't know what, but it's not a fun place to be. Oh, and hey, hey! Oh, jeez. Oh, there's an explosion. Let's just not look at it. Okay, okay, yeah. I feel like that's best. And, uh, I did light up this one, but I've already been through here. I think this row I just ran through and lit up a bunch of them. You know what, let's try that again. Already been through this one. Light up that side. Nothing here. Oh, I'm out of glowstone. Oh well. Okay, nothing here. I would appreciate it if you would just die. Thank you very much. 
Okay, this area is secure. There we go. I need to eat a little bit. There's a creeper directly up. Oh, he can't even get to us. Okay. Nothing here. Nothing here. Ow! These skeletons are just getting annoying. Well, that's exactly what I've been saying this entire time, but... Hey, hey, hey! Get back! Okay. And this will be the last one in this row. Okay. And more mobs up here. Now, did I actually get through all of the ones over here? Ah, there it is. We got it. I'm not really afraid of uh, getting out of here. Or maybe I should be, though. Got that regeneration potion out. Alrighty. See, that was so much easier. And, wow, did I stop right here? No. But there is a chest in there. Doesn't really matter what it is, though, because we're leaving. We have the last wall. So, we've got 15 minutes left on this record. Get out of here! Uh, we have 15 minutes left on this recording. And, uh... That should be plenty of time to get back to the Victory Monument, right? If not, then, you know, oh well. We'll, uh... Uh, we'll just add on to that video. Or, uh, add on to this video until it's done. <clears throat> because we now have all the walls, so... I really see no ne no reason to, uh... Continue going, you know. Um, there's the... I've got a black wool here, but that's not the one we want to bring. We want to bring the red wool. Just bringing one of each. And let's go. we got plenty of bread to sustain us on our way home. I don't know why I went this way. I don't think this way even actually leads out Oh, yes it does. Alright. I'd love to just go that way instead of going all the way around, but um, I don't have a safe path that way, and I'm carrying precious cargo here, so... Nope! No more getting shot. That's for sure. Oh, and I did check, and... Uh, yeah, ooh, ooh, ooh. Nightmare Realms is a normal map now. Uh, everything else that he has made, except with the exception of the mini... Uh, Mini hostile, mini super, I don't know, <laughs> the Rage Quit Holidays thing he made, um, which is on a hardcore map, um, is easy, including Legendary, which I think is a little ridiculous, because it's not really that easy, or at least not from what I've seen. Um, there are no ROM hack hard maps, well, to be honest with you, I think the, um, the super, the mini hostile, the, I don't even know what it's called. I'm going to call it the mini hostile, because I can't remember for the life of me what it's called. Um, the mini hostile map is listed as hard, not rom hack hard, and I feel that it should be considered rom hack hard, because it is nearly impossible. Um, like I said, I did try it before. Uh, I don't know if you actually caught it when I said that, but um, I did try it. And I, I managed to get two-thirds of the way through the map by backing up my map. Uh, I, I died like a bajillion times. And uh, I just backed up my map every time I got to a wool box. And uh, probably went through a good 50 worlds. And then died like 30 times on the last portion, because it's a mini one, so there's only three wolves. And yeah, really probably died like 30 times on that last little portion and decided that uh, it wasn't happening. And I guess 50 is probably an understatement, because I believe that 30 is probably an accurate representation of how many times I died on that last one. And uh, I died way more times than that throughout the whole thing. But at least I was making progress on the other ones. I didn't even know how to make progress on the last part. So I don't know what I'm doing there. Um, so that was a little a little rough, and uh, I really feel like that should be ROM hack hard if it isn't. Um, I don't know why I put that sand there, I was just, I just felt like I should, and there's actually a chest right there. <laughs> um, 
I was saying I, I'm watching Vex's uh, developer commentary, and he he made a very very subtle hint that there's an axe up there. <laughs> he was standing over on that thing. He was like, you know, if you're lucky, you might find an axe, <clears throat> a, an, an enchanted axe. You know, if you if you if you're lucky, you might find one. <clears throat> so, don't knock me off. There we go. Let's just go up there and see what that axe is like. You know, just for fun. Let's see if it's like a... Oh, I don't remember what it was called, but we had we had an axe on Sea of Flame. That was pretty cool. Okay, now I've totally lost it, by the way, so... I'm going to have to figure out where it was. It's up. <laughs> I know it's up! Does that count? And it's on this side. Was it this one? I thought it was this one. Oh, it's up there. I I'm glad there's water underneath us here. We'll have no problem uh, getting back down. But yeah, uh, he said there was one secret chest in this in this uh, cave here. Rage fell the clear cutter. Efficiency four and breaking five, or efficiency five and breaking four. Fortune three, sharpness four, five. Oh, I always think that's four. The V. I don't know why. Looting three. So I guess that's good for a weapon, but you know, which probably actually works better than the axe we have. But anyway, that you know, he said there was one secret chest, and I was like, but what about that? Like I was thinking, oh, there it is. Uh, actually, that's a different one. We haven't been to that one. We went over there to one. Wee. I really would have expected that to hurt. Particularly if it was in real life, but... Psh, screw real life. We're playing Minecraft. I want to see what's up there, actually. How, many, how much time do we have left? We have eight minutes. Oh, well. This episode's just going to be us chilling and having fun. Because, uh... I'm pretty much done with this map. So... Um, sorry, my mom came into my room. Um, so, uh, what was I talking about? <laughs> Get back. I wonder how much damage this axe actually actually does. Mm, two shots zombies. Probably would have been nice to have before, but nope, nope, no. Oh, I hate, I hate creepers. I forget this axe doesn't have knockback, so I need to be careful for that. Um... So, we're just going to have fun here. You know, no point in getting all racy about it. That's not the word I was looking for. Oh, oh. I didn't actually look where it was before I started building, so. I know it was in the coal. And now I'm really confused. <laughs> oh, well, it looks like it's over the water, at least. Or I'm going to back up so I can see the water. Or so I can jump into the water. I don't know what I'm talking about, guys. Where'd it go? Oh no, it was way up there. Well, it's definitely over the water. Alrighty. Oh wow. That worked out perfectly. Let's see uh, what this was. Is it's probably just more coal. Coal. Oh well. That's nice. I need to remember to look up in the next maps. Um, Vex actually has a super docile map, um, called Hills of Moo, and, uh, I may go ahead and play some of that, because it's kind of like, I was expecting it to break really fast because it's got efficiency 5, but apparently not. Well, this one? Oh, well, yeah, that breaks in one hit. <laughs> um, that's just like instant break. Knock it back!
That skeleton just hit himself with an arrow. Gotta love Minecraft, how things like that can happen. <laughs> because, uh, honestly, I don't know any other game that can do stuff like that. Um, again, I'm really sorry if you can hear my mom's music, because uh, she's blasting it, apparently. Um, and the bass is shaking the floor, so. That's cool. Not a whole lot, but still. It's a little ridiculous. Um... I mean, I'm not saying I don't play my own music that loud sometimes, but definitely not when she's home. Um, alrighty. Let's head on over here. I never did end up getting these vines down. <laughs> well, now they're just like one-hit one hit kills. Like, they're not really killing them, are we? They're just tearing them down. Well, I suppose that would be killing it, wouldn't it? They are vines, after all. I need to be careful with this thing around my victory monument, or I'm just going to destroy the whole thing. Just run and accidentally mow down your victory monument. Eek. That would suck. Okay. Where are they? Green wool, red wool. Hooray! Alright, we did find this together. Yeah. That's where we started. Humble beginnings, eh? A. I'm not Canadian. And one time, I was just like on some chat room somewhere, I don't remember, and I said something about Canadians saying A, right? And this guy's like, I'm Canadian, and no Canadians I know say that. And I was like, well, my stepmom's Canadian, and her family says A all the time. Oh, I really thought that was going to hurt. And that's very true. Uh, like, I, I noticed, because, yeah, my stepmom's Canadian, so, um, throughout the time that, uh, because my, my dad remarried when I was very young, um, so she's been around for a while, but, uh, her family says A all the time. So I was kind of surprised when that guy was like, Psh, Canadians don't say A. And I was like, uh, want to bet? <laughs> um, I really don't know why I'm digging down. Maybe we'll fall out of the map here. I figured we'd come back and just, uh, jeez, how deep are we? Or Almost all the way down. Um, but yeah, that's just a little bit of my life, apparently. Um, oh, bedrock. Yay! Um, so yeah. Uh, let's see. Oh, I may just start on another map. Like, I want to try Goods 404 Challenge, just because um, that was pretty cool. Or that looks pretty cool. I haven't, I haven't seen any videos for it, or even or tried anything about it myself. I just realized there's this big white spot right in the middle of the cobblestone texture. That's really weird. Anyway, um, I haven't seen it or heard or anything about uh, Good's map, but I would definitely like to try it because I've I just watched their uh, I just finished watching their uh, Nightmare Realms videos, and that w oh hey it's night time, or daytime ish okay uh let's uh i don't know let's jump into this hole and die and i guess that'll be the end of the episode <laughs> um let's see i can't hit my oh there we go I'm trying to check the time oh we got 2 minutes left what great timing already our wheat farm over there <laughs> stayed there throughout the entire map and just uh, never really got used that much. So that's unfortunate. Oh, height limit. Yeah, he said he put this chest up here as like a constellation prize. Because he's there's a sign down there somewhere that says that... Um, I'm going to spawn all the way back over there, aren't I? Oh, wrong side. Oh, no. <laughs> I meant to die on the spawn point, but that didn't work so well. But uh, anyway... Uh, yeah. So I guess that's the end of this episode, and, uh, this little series that we've got going on here. So, um, I'm just trying to think of any last words that I can get in here. Um, I was trying to, I was trying to land in that hole, but then I just jumped off the wrong side, so that didn't work so well. Let's... Hey, this is the only Opus guy here in the map, so there's no reason to go up the bedrock ceiling. It will not connect to anything else. So he said he put that up there just as like a little consolation prize for anybody who wants to go up there, like I did, because <laughs> I didn't believe him. 
he was like, you know, if somebody doesn't believe me, then they can go up there and they'll get a little chest. And I think there was like some torches and maybe a golden apples and a sword or whatever in there. Um, so that was cool. And uh, let's head back in here and check it out. I'm just feeling a little nostalgic, you know. It's been a long time since we've been here. There's our <laughs> retarded tree that we were trying to grow in here that uh, didn't really want to cooperate. Here's the cactus that I never actually gathered. The enchanting table that I never used. We have some... No, we don't have any experience because I just died. Ah. Um, it was funny listening to Vex talk on his developer commentary because he comes down here and uh, he comes in here and he's like, I don't know why people destroy these, which actually I didn't destroy them, which kind of surprises me a little bit. Um, so normally I just run in and destroy them all. But, oh, I did wall this off though. Another rack. I like this area. This is a nice little. Get out of here. This is a nice little area. I think, at least. I feel like there should be something hidden under here, though. Of which there seems to be nothing. Or of such. Of. Of which. Of. I don't know. Anyway. This is the wool that started it all. Uh, no. No. That's not true. This. It, this is the wool that started it all. After we've got them all, I'm just going to come back here. And break the chest. And let's just uh, throw all this in the ground. Burn it. Yay! Okay. <laughs> so I, uh, yeah, I guess I'm just uh, trying to fill in here because I don't want this little series to end. But as always, there will be another one. So you can look forward to that. Cave noises. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you around.